this says China stop supporting the dictator because Xi Jinping, the president of China, is a dictator too. So, the team is here, Janet Katawa Museveni, Mohosi, Salim Saleh, and their big man, Yori Museveni. These are the murderers of Uganda. I can say that openly as a journalist because I've seen people being killed by the people who have been sent by these people. So, the message going on here is saying, stop Airco, China stop supporting the dictator. And right here is the Chinese embassy, the way you see it. And that's why you can stay there together here and send their message to these people to stop supporting whatever is going on in this country, Uganda. The message is still passing and going on, you see. End Iacop means end East African construction of the pipeline because rights have been abused, the way they evict people, the way the people are dying in Uganda, the disrespect of human rights in the country by the people who say they were elected to be presidents of Uganda, yet Mr. Robert Chagulani Sentamu could be the right president of Uganda, but the elections were rigged and no one had the chance to shout out and say, you guys, we elected someone else, and if you have the election, the elections man declared Mr. Museven without anything that was going to help Ugandans. You can see the messages. Um, oil is Uganda's resource, not Chinese, because of course Uganda is gaining just very many factories down there in Hoima. They are trying to see that they gain out of the resource through Museven's dictatorship. One time, many Ugandans have been arrested down there in Kamocha when they were posting these photos of bring back our people. Right now, more than 300 Ugandans were arrested as political prisoners. More than a thousand Ugandans ran away from Uganda to many countries like South Africa, like Kenya, like Zambia. Uh, yesterday, I was watching the Secretary General of the National Enterprise from David Lewis Lubongoya. He was saying very many Ugandans are running out of Uganda. Why? Are fleeing Uganda. Why? Because they fear being killed because of the regime that does not allow anything that does with opposition on the regime that is headed by Yoweri Kakuta Museveni. Recently he promoted his literally Ugandans, Ugandans call him general manager. I don't know why he's a general manager but he promoted him after him tweeting to Kenya saying that he will attack Kenya, <laughs> you wonder whatever is happening in the country. Okay, the leader Haman Ainemiona is going to speak to us and tell us why we are here and send the message to you, you can oh, answer. Is it English? Whatever, uh -huh. Uganda English. Thank you for watching, thank you for following. Um, we are here at the Chinese Embassy in New York. We are demonstrating against corruption from the Chinese. You know, there's a lot of property that has been uh, sold from Uganda to China, uh, including our airport. So we are here to express our dissatisfaction. Uh, we are here to communicate in a language that we, are, we understand most and in a peaceful, democratic way to communicate to the Chinese government that we are not happy with what they are doing with Museven. So we are here, keep following, keep watching. But too far, I know it's okay now to French embassy in Ayo. Manga na boba, Bali kubi, to be a eco period, so to be a chakala nyemu. Then, to be a koma, keep watching, keep following. Thank you, Kassili Asha, for being here, my brother. We appreciate you. You are welcome. We are still continuing. We are about to leave this place, and these Ukrainians are going to go to the French embassy still and shout out that the EU was right to stop this construction of the Iacop. Iacop is a scam. That's cancel Semakad. Iacop is a scam. Yes, it is. It is a scam. It is a scam. 
huyu tani na kusangiwa mu Uganda Uganda ni mbona ku nusu 15 zoka so sad so sad aba Faransa na aba China batware nusu zangu kwa hiyo wafe this is a scam this is a scam but that contract pala mchezaji aba anga ko atinga mateka ya Gaisa ya Isa biche byo bitala bako Jiko is a scam China is a scam. China is a scam. Don't go to China. 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 China is a scam. 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 All those with a China is a scam. China stop stealing our oil. Yes. I know they take the wetland, they take our wetland. Display our flag, guys. Display our flag. We have our flag. Display it. Yes, yes, yes. Because Ugandans are godly people. We are, dem we are dedicating our demonstration before God. Yes. So let's pray. Heavenly yes. Father, the Lord of heaven and earth. The God of Abraham, the God of Jacob, the God of Isaac, this is Uganda. It's a prayer right now. We are crying to you, Lord. We are crying to you, Lord. Lord, you gave us our country, Uganda. You gave us our country, Uganda, and Africa. Thank you for watching Ghetto TV and all other media platforms. My name is Kasiri Ashraf. Yeah, trying to stream live on Facebook. Of course, very soon we shall be live on YouTube, on Twitter, so that we use all the platforms that can send messages of Ugandans, mistreated Ugandans whose rights are being abused the entire world. And maybe one day, yes, one day this struggle will yield something and of course he has already yielded and Mr. M7 now thinks many people were behind such stopping the ear cop against Uganda yet he has been receiving money from the time in memorial when he got money from Gaddafi during the push war he got money from Europe he got money from USA he got money from all the countries to be able to abuse the rights of you.